Brittany Griner on her way home now after a high-profile prisoner swap. It comes nearly 10 months after she was detained in Russia for having cannabis oil in her luggage. She's expected to land in San Antonio tonight where she'll receive medical care at Brook Army Medical Center. Deborah Alvaron is at the White House with today's prisoner swap. Video from Russian state media shows Brittany Griner leaving a Russian penal colony on her way back home to America. Happy. <laughs> the WNBA star was part of a prisoner swap for international arms dealer Victor Boot, known as the Merchant of Death. The two are seen crossing paths on this tarmac in Abu Dhabi. Congratulations. Griner's wife, Sherelle, thanked President Biden at the White House. Today is just a happy day for me and my family, so um, I'm going to smile right now. <laughs> Left out of the deal was Marine veteran Paul Whelan, who has been imprisoned in Russia since 2018 on espionage charges. For totally illegitimate reasons, Russia is treating Paul's case differently than Britney's. U.S. officials say including Whelan was a non-starter for the Russians in the months of negotiations, but they vowed to keep fighting for his release. This was not a choice of which American to bring home. The choice was one or none. Boot was serving a 25-year sentence for conspiring to kill Americans. Critics of the president say the U.S. should have gotten a better deal for him. There are answers that I need to receive before uh, I can applaud the Biden administration on this. Whelan's brother says the administration made the right decision, though the family is still devastated that he remains in Russia. The math is not going to work out for Paul to come home anytime soon. This is President Biden's second prisoner exchange with Russia. In April, Marine veteran Trevor Reed was traded for a Russian drug smuggler. Deborah Alfaron, CBS News, the White House.